Hey guys, welcome to Transwest Truck Trailer RV. And I'm your host, Marlon Bledman, here at uh, one of your truck sales guys. And today, I want to bring a very special friend uh, right behind me. It's a member of my family. Um, so I know the owner pretty on a personal level. So I, I would tell you as much as I know about this 2017 Toyota Tacoma uh, TRD Sport. So we're going to take a quick look at this one. Like I said, it's a 2017 super low mileage, just under 35,000 miles. My brother-in-law actually owned this vehicle and right now it is part of Transwest collection. As we take a look, he did a, a few upgrades through the, uh, the Toyota dealership here in Colorado, um, added this metal crash bar added the light bar system on there as well. Beautiful headlights, the Toyota sign is amazing. Gonna take a look at the engine. All right, as you guys can see, um, right now the engine actually show D4S V6, so um, it basically it's a 3.5 liter V6 engine. This Toyota Tacoma actually produces 278 horsepower and 265 foot-pounds of torque. Everything has been well maintained. We got your power steering fluid, you got your coolant, you got your uh, window washer wiper fluid. All change has been done. Everything is set and ready to go. You don't have to worry about maintenance for a long, long time. So just your normal, all changes on this vehicle. Like I said, it's a one owner. Um, like I said, it is personal, so it is a family vehicle, um, well taken care of. He added those rims and tires to it. It's Goodyear, and those tires are 285-7017s. As you can see, it was lifted about three inches, so it's a little higher than the regular Tacoma height. So um, it's not too high for um, uh, regular people. Yeah, you know, anybody could enter in and out of this vehicle with ease. As you can see, those running boards were added also, so that was an addition to the truck um, with the steps included on both sides of the vehicle. The interior actually came with cloth, um, but he added this expensive leatherette co seat covers, and those actually allows the airbags on the seats when it deploys, it actually allows the airbags to come out. So it is super safe, very safe for um, your normal um, daily day driving. Um, so if anything happens and you're in an accident, those um, airbags on the side will actually pop out from these uh, seat covers. So there are expensive seat covers, so they were, they were made right. All leather tech, weather tech, sorry, um, mats inside for easy cleaning. Um, we did show you the light bar in front, and there is a light bar in the back, but um, it's a little different. So with the switch here, turns on the light bar in the front. Um, and in the back, the reverse um, light, we have two options. If you want to see light during the day um, or in the night, just want to see the light from the back, you could put, push it down and that would turn on the light in the back. Um, if you put it in the middle, it turns it off at, um, at all times. Like all power to that light bar in the back will be off. If you push it up front, this will actually, once you put your vehicle in reverse, that light will actually come on um, on re when you reverse the vehicle. It does have a light on the bed, so you have that on, door, and, and off. Off, door, and on. So that light in the bed will actually come on once the doors are open. Um, you do have a plug-in in the back, and this is the, uh, the switch to turn it on and off. Um, and I'll show you that, guys that in the back of the bed. Um, you do have the controls for your rear, um, your rear window in the back and I'll show you guys that also. So this is the controls for that. All powered windows, power mirrors, um, 
as we continue in the back. Tons of room for the family. Could sit an additional three people in the back. Like I said, he added leather all, all around. So if in case you do not want the leather seating, um, it's in great condition, but um, the cloth seats are like brand new underneath this. So from the day he bought it, he added that to the, to the truck. So right now underneath those are brand new cloth seats. So I don't know why you would want to take this out, but you have an option for leather or cloth, which is cool. You don't get that much. Um, here is your fuel tank over here. Um, it's about 21 gallons. So, um, and the uh, MPG is uh, 19 in the city and 24 on the highway. So you could do the, you could do the math and see how much, how far you could go with this truck. Like I said, the tires were added. Um, it does have a bed liner cover on there, which is actually cool. So if in case you want to store stuff in here, um, you have that covering that is waterproof. Um, so all your belongings could be in the, underneath the or in the bed and will not get wet So you have that option as well, which is pretty cool um, And of course this was from the Toyota factory as well um, There is that plug-in I was telling you guys about right here so you could plug in an air pump um, plug in like a, a saw or whatever you want to use outdoor um, and that switch up front will actually power this up for you. Um, some storage compartments here, just to store little tools or whatever you have in here. Tie downs, they are adjustable, so it goes all the way down. They got four areas for that as well. And they are adjustable, so you could actually unscrew and actually move it around. So it has that option as well. So this is what it's all about. Clean bed. Just minor little scratches, of course, it is plastic, so anything that's rough on the edges will, will touch it up a bit. So this actually goes all the way back. So you, if you wanna leave this on and carry stuff, you have the option of that as well. I think it has one more fold. So it's on both sides, so you will need somebody else to be with you, but it actually folds up and actually latches in with the uh, with a clip. Easy to close. And you're done. Uh, it does come with, like I was saying, he added the, uh, the metal back bumper as well. So this is all metal. Um, it does come with a tow package bumper pool. So it's right underneath the... Uh, license plate so it's kind of cool so out when you don't, when you're using it you don't even see there is a, a bumper pool here but once you lift this up you could actually see the connection right here it does come with your four pin and seven pin attachment right here to hook up your trailers and stuff these are the lights i was telling you guys about you could actually turn those on at night and it's super bright so if you're working in an area at night and you just need some some light and you don't want to turn the, the truck around you could actually turn those two lights on and it's bright, it's bright. Um, and like I said, in reverse, once you have that switch on in reverse, these lights actually come on when you put the, uh, the vehicle in reverse. So whoever is behind you will actually see you coming. So that's a good little safety feature right here. So as we take a look inside, just gonna show you a few things here. Got a few cup holders in the doors. Nice storage compartment, glove box here as well. Come with all your manuals that you need. Everything is in there. Like I said, it was well maintained, one owner. All right, ladies first. Like I said, it was uh, lifted three inches off the ground, off like the regular height of the uh, the truck. Um, it does come with a sunroof, so you have that option here as well. And the switches on here actually shows you open, close, up or down, which is super easy. You don't have to figure out, okay, which button is to open and stuff like that. So everything is uh, clearly labeled and of course it makes sense.
All right, so right now it's open. I'm gonna press close, hold down and close, release. It's gonna close that. And it's all about the sunroof here. Um, it does come with a little uh, sunglass case here. Um, this does come with navigation. Great sound for radio. You could actually add your apps on here. Um, you could um, have your, your hands-free calling. You can see what the traffic is like, is like um, weather, and of course your messages and stuff. So once you hook up your phone into that, it's pretty cool. Heated seats for the front, your AC control. It is four wheel drive, so you have the option of turning to four high or four or low. Um, it is uh, keyless entry and keyless start, so you have that push button start right here. Um, it does have blank spot monitors, so that's where you could turn it on or off, which is pretty cool. Um, you have your back, uh, your sensors as well. That's where you turn it on and off. Um, you have your USB and auxiliary inputs right here. Your nine volt or 12 volt hookup right here. And of course it has a very nice feature, which is um, for all your wireless charging phones. Um, it has that button right here. So right now the light is on. Now you can see it's off. If I turn this on, and my phone is wireless charging. I could just drop my phone in here and the light will actually turn on to tell you to let you know that it's charging. Once the charging is done, it will turn green on this side, which is awesome. So you know when your phone is completely charged. Um, like I said, this vehicle only has 30, less than 35,000 miles on it. So it has tons of life in it. Um, if you guys will have any questions about this vehicle or any other vehicle on our lot, um, just give us a call. You could call me directly or you could call our store. Uh, my name is Marlon Bledman. Um, office number 303-684-3412. Or you could call me on my cell 661-755-4344. Or you could email me with your questions or if you want to set an appointment at marlon.bledman at transwest.com. Um, if you guys have any further questions, let me know. Um, like I said, this vehicle was a one owner, less than 35,000 miles, 2017. Stock number on this one is 5U200754. All right. So once again, Marlon Blayman here with another amazing video. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for another one. And I hope you guys have a great day and see you guys soon. Bye.